hello and you're watching a tutorial video for the spin and translate task. What this tool allows you to do is to bulk spin and translate pre-existing articles on your hard drive. So the tool is located on the left hand side under tools, spin and translate. To create a new task, I go to the right hand side and click on new spin and translator. So now this is the interface for my spin and translate task. So the first thing I want to do is obviously select a location where my articles are on my hard drive. Once I've done that, I can choose the location where to save the spun and translated articles. By default, it's going to use SEO Content Machine's install app data folder, which is designated by this macro project folder. I can choose whether or not I want the final output of my articles to have the spin text symbols in them or maybe not to have those spin text symbols in them. Here is my list of article translators I can use. I can also enable a rewriter and also choose a list of rewriters. So in terms of order, spin and translate tool is always going to translate your article first and then rewrite it. And it's for the simple reason that most article rewriters, they will create content with your spin text symbols. And you can't send those spin text symbol text into translators as most of them will not be able to read and correctly understand the content. Which is why we must translate our articles first and then run a article rewriter on top. So once I'm happy with all my settings, and don't forget to enter either your API settings for your translator or your spinner. And for both of these, we have these two handy links which you can click on. Once you're happy with your task, all you have to do is click run, or you can save it and you can edit the task and run it later.